Hey guys, Jules from Sprint Booster here. Today we're installing a Sprint Booster in this 2015 Hyundai Genesis Coupe. As always, you're going to want to start by opening your driver's side door, taking your key fob about 20 feet away. This allows the vehicle's CAN bus system to reset. When you're installing the Sprint Booster on this particular vehicle, you will notice it does have a floor-mounted pedal. The first step to taking the pedal off is removing the cap that covers the retainer bolt. There is only one single bolt. It is an 11 millimeter bolt. Remove that bolt and remove the pedal. Next, you're going to remove the pedal assembly from the vehicle. To do this, you press on the sides of the clip while pulling outwards. Next, place the Sprint Booster in line between the harness and the pedal. Remember to press in until it clicks. After that, connect the selector switch to the Sprint Booster unit itself. Now is a good time to use the adhesive material on the back to choose where you want to mount the selector switch. Now that you have the Sprint Booster installed, reinstall the pedal assembly. Take that 11mm bolt, screw it back in, and then replace the pedal cover. And that's it for the install for the Sprint Booster on this 2015 Hyundai Genesis Coupe 3.8. Leave us a comment below to let us know what vehicle you'd like to see featured next, or you can contact us at SprintBoosterUSA.com.